NASA confirms half-ton meteor crashed in South Texas. Let's dive into the details, shall we? Nearly a, a nearly 1,000-pound meteor measuring two feet wide crashed into South Texas on Wednesday, according to reports. <clears throat> Fox station KDFW in Dallas reported that NASA confirmed the meteor broke apart as it fell through the atmosphere to its resting place near McAllen, Texas at about 6 p.m. It's because it's only two feet <clears throat> wide and it's a ton. How is any or half a ton? How? Although meteorites tend to hit Earth's atmosphere at high speeds, they slow as they travel through the atmosphere, breaking into small fragments before hitting the ground. Meteorites cool rapidly and generally are not at risk to the public, NASA said in a statement. <clears throat> The space agency posted a report of the incident along with a map showing an area where pieces of the meteor likely landed. KWFW or KDFW posted a video captured from a home security camera with birds scattering and the sound of a sonic boom. Here's the map. We can watch that video real quick. Kind of uneventful, but yeah, you hear the boom uh, in the background. Slammed in. <clears throat> yeah, interesting. According to National Weather Service in Brownsville, Rio Grande Valley, multiple people reported a possible meteor in the sky west of McAllen. The weather agency also reported that the flash from the meteor was captured by a geostationary lightning mapper right before 5.30 p.m. <clears throat> The lightning mapper satellite measures lightning from space and in a Facebook post on Wednesday that NWS said there was no thunderstorm activity in the area when the meteor crashed. <clears throat> Hidalgo County Sheriff Eddie uh, Gira posted to Twitter that he was informed by air traffic controllers in Houston that two aircraft reported they also saw the meteor in the sky near McAllen. The meteor seen in the skies above McAllen is a reminder of the need for NASA and other organizations to increase our understanding and protection of Earth to combine scientific and engineering expertise to advance human space exploration to integrate terrestrial and planetary research for furthering our understanding of the solar system and to promote successful space missions by mitigating risk, NASA said. <clears throat> Yeah, kind of interesting. I wonder where that meteor landed and who's going to find it. It's crazy. How is it two feet wide, but it's um, it's two feet wide, but it weighs a thousand pounds. That's just crazy. Um, but what do you, what is your opinion on the story? Please let me know in the comments below. Also, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for daily news updates. Hit that notification bell and share this video to help spread the news. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.